Hey guys, welcome back again. In this video, I'm going to answer the most asked question is there is any way through which you can rank your website without SEO. If you're searching for the same thing, then make sure you stay till the end because in this video, I'm going to explain everything about what is SEO, how SEO works, and do you really need SEO to rank your website? Hey guys, my name is Kirti Shwas. I am from bloggingverse.com and I do provide more details about blogging, passive incomes and various ways through which you can make income just sitting in your home. So if you're new to this channel, then make sure you click to the subscribe button and don't forget to hit the bell icon so you, so you will keep getting related videos in the future as well and can boost your income. So without wasting time, let's get started. Hey guys, so first let's talk about how SEO works and why SEO need it. Remember guys, ultimately whenever you are creating your website, then your ultimate goal is to rank those websites into the search engine, such as Google, Yahoo, Bing and etc. In those search engines, they have their own bots or I should say they have their own artificial intelligence. So basically those bots will visit your website that's known as a crawler. Once they visit your website, they downloaded all the files such as HTML, JavaScript, CSS and everything those files actually pass to the its a rending mechanism basically it read the data and try to understand what your content is all about once it actually understand that content then after it pass that data to the indexer and your website will get certain positioning into that particular search engine database here when it comes to search engine then we should mainly focus around the google itself because more than 70 percent of the worldwide search engine market is actually around Google only. So let's talk about this is how the Google works. Okay, so now what exactly and why you need it as you remember guys what I said earlier in search engine is just an artificial intelligence or it's just a bot. It is actually an automatic bot and definitely you have to help that bot to understand what you have written about. Let's take an example. If I'm coming to uh, if I'm going for an interview in a specific company, then that company has certain specific requirement. If you will not follow if you are not eligible for that requirement, then after you are not eligible to appear for that interview. The same case here in the SEO. If you are not fulfilling the basic criteria of what any search engine is looking for, and if you're not helping that search engine to understand your content, that means you are not able to rank. That means you will not able to rank your website in the Google and the same case is here. So the short answer is yes, guys, you need an SEO. SEO is something where basically you are optimizing your content based on the need of the search engine so that whenever the search engine crawler will visit your website, it can easily understand what exactly you have written and for what you you are willing to rank your website. But now to do as you guys, there are two important parts you have to think about. It's not a difficult job and it's not something which you are not aware of. So the one is the technical SEO and second one is a non-technical SEO. So when it comes to non-technical SEO guys, basically that is more about writing a content and sharing your content on various places so that Google can easily understand like your content is valuable. People are interacting, people are getting the value out of it, that's part of a non-SEO techniques. So basically, in this technique, you can optimize your content doing the on-page SEO and off-page SEO. To understand uh, more about on-page and off-page, basically you can check out my blog, bloggingos.com. Otherwise, you can check the previous videos on this channel. I will provide the link in the i button. But the most important part is the technical SEO. So the technical SEO could be of various part, but there are a couple of things you have to understand. What are the technical SEO? Basically, here we are helping to the search engine to understand what your site is all about. So the number one is, guys, you have to make sure your website speed is good enough it should not take more than six or seven seconds or I should say the ideal website loading speed should be three to four seconds. If this is the condition, that means your website is eligible to rank and you will be having no issue. That's number one. And that also depends on what type of theme you are using, what type of web hosting you are using. And if you're looking for the best recommendations on the theme and hosting, make sure you check the videos in the i button. So that was the number one. Now let's talk about the second second technical SEO part, which is the robot.txt file. You know, as I said, every search engine had its own robot. Basically, that robot will visit your website. So in your website, you will be having a file with the name of robots.txt. 
this file will actually grant an access to that particular bot whether to uh, allow crawling of your website or not. So make sure your website should have robots.txt and it should allow to crawl that particular search engine crawler throughout the site. That actually help that, uh, that crawler to understand what you have written all about. Now let's go to this third part guys is more about creating a sitemap. Sitemap is something like basically you are structuring your website in such a way so that whenever the crawler will visit your website it can easily navigate to the different section of your website website to understand or to learn more about sitemap make sure you provide me in the comments so i will make a detailed video on that otherwise we already have enough information on site bloggingverse.com so make sure you have created your website sitemap now let's talk about the next important part is guys make sure your website url is very well optimized basically it explains to the crawler what exactly the content all about and how and what exactly you are targeting in the website url guys or make sure your website url is using https instead of HTTP. So guys, these are the couple of things from the technical perspective you have to look around your website. If you're fulfilling all this criteria, then you are actually finished with SEO. So guys, SEO is mandatory and everybody has to do that. But this is not something like a rocket science or different than what you are doing right now. I know that you are already doing SEO, but these are the couple of things which you have to make sure whenever you are optimizing your website so that basically you are helping that crawler to understand what your content is all about and how exactly your site is helping uh, or sharing a value to the people. I hope guys, so this uh, video has answered your queries and the ultimately I should say, yes, you have to do SEO in order to rank the website in the search engine. So this is something I hope guys this uh, been added some value to your learning. If you are willing me to make such kind of videos, then make sure you hit subscribe, like in and share as much as possible. So I will keep making and adding value to your learning as well. Thank you very much. And don't forget to subscribe, like, and also join our Facebook page to learn more about blogging and almost everything about passive income. Thank you very much for watching this.